All right, I'm standing on the football field on Saddle Peak, just outside in the back country, out of bounds south of Bridger Bowl. And the, this big avalanche here broke six to eight feet, probably more deep, and it wraps all the way around the face of the peak. Since Wednesday, it's Saturday now, over the last three days, we've had almost four feet of snow with almost four inches of snow water equivalent in it. And so this ran sometime mid-storm a couple days ago. Fortunately, it went naturally and nobody was out here. Um, but this points out two things. We have a similar snowpack structure throughout the advisory area with weak sugary snow on the ground. And where these, these haven't broke naturally, a human could trigger them. For the next few days, we just received a big load from the bridges to Cook City and West Yellowstone. And two, Saddle Peak is dangerous avalanche terrain. As soon as you go out of bounds, all of this is steep. Even the runout zones down below are dangerous. So if you ever head out here, you need to do so very thoughtfully uh, before, before committing and carry all the proper gear and go with the partner and make a good plan.